say hi. I have to jump in the car. We're in Mid Ohio. It's gonna be great. It's a new weekend. It looks like it's gonna rain, but it's not gonna rain. Enjoy. I watched 30 for 30 on professional like eating last night. Have you ever seen that? Well, I've seen it, but I haven't seen the documentary. So fascinating. The second career for you? No. Isn't that so good? <laughs> Yeah, I mean, I think we're back to where we start. It feels like it has a lot of grip, actually. Okay. Really good. I was surprised how high the grip was. Yeah, I mean, generally our teammates sound pretty pretty happy, so I think maybe these starting dampers are a step from last year, anyways. I do too, yeah. It felt really good, yeah. grip wise. So, I mean, I think 12 felt like they got some traffic on there. I mean, just theoretical for a quarter thing of Aston Awards. Same sort of deal. Arby's, yeah, it's uh, similar to that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Like that's that's the ranking on the theoretical yeah. too. So our weakest like sector is such a half down there. So like, twelve thirteen. Eleven twelve thirteen. We'll have a look at it. Yeah, I this can be a lot better. I never had a great yeah. run through all of it. Yeah, that's where it looks like we've got the most maybe the game, but it's not like terrible. Everyone. Yeah, ten ten to nine. Yeah. If you add up, both, I mean, both combined. if you add up three sectors together, yeah, it's somewhere there. Let's see. Yeah, it's like five hundred something. Let's give it to. Um, the control out, for sure. Better with CT off? Yeah. Um, it was a good session. You know, I, the, the thing I noticed right away was our car felt phenomenal. Just right away. I was super, super happy. So we got to keep it up. You know, temperature is going to change this weekend. Maybe not so much tomorrow, but, but for Sunday, I think we'll be quite a bit different temp-wise. So, yeah, just going to try and stay prepared, but, you know, hold the speed that we have right now. If we can do that, then we'll be in good shape. I get it. <laughs> Keeping the same rhythm. Yeah. Yep. Fine with me. Heard this. Come scan a few people here if they come in early. Yeah. Come early. Yeah. I think I'm easy. Worst case is getting picked by traffic or like getting caught out because we're off sequence to other people, right? Yeah. So, I don't know. We'll see. I think it's 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 a safer play. Let's do it that way. It's gonna be quick and like it's gonna be near the end of running for that. Yeah. So, yep. Hey, how are you? I'm good, uh, how are you, Chief? Good, I'm doing good. I'm ready. I had a pretty good practice session this morning. Car was uh, still good, trying to figure it out on reds. I didn't totally nail the lap, but I um, think the speed's in it. Try and get things a little bit more close, balance-wise, where they need to be. Temperature's coming up a little bit, track temp's coming up. Just trying to prepare for that. Um, but yeah, it's qualifying time. Go fast time. Neat. You know how it is. Neat. <laughs> Neat. was going to be the money lap on used tires for reds and opened the lap really well and then i just started losing time as i got to turn four all the way to the line i was just trying to keep it together i was like man we got to do like a six I, tim was telling me exactly what i needed um and we just got it so i'm really proud of everybody obviously the xbl car looks good and it's fast and team chevy's done a great job so we just need to keep it together tomorrow have a good good clean day i think we can do that i think we have the car and we're capable so yeah hopefully it goes well are you Joseph? It's going to be fun. <laughs> I needed that third though. Money. The car was good. Yeah, yeah no, we played it right. Nice work. All right, everybody, get the pull. Get him, Ward. Master crew chief. Woo! Well, en engineer, sorry. Travis Wallace, our crew chief. Um, yeah, it's great. Thanks, Travis. It felt inside that. Yeah. I thought it, yeah, I thought it was plastic. Mm. It felt. That must be for um, Galera. Yeah. Yeah. Big felt guy. I'm yeah. I'm not a big felt guy actually. St lint sticks to it. I don't like that. But you can't have glare, I guess, on the middle of that or on the outside rim there. Well, you know what you don't want is glare on your rim. You don't want that's, any glare on your rim. That's gonna ruin your day. But you do want P1 awards. You do want P1 awards. That's very true. 
Uh, good things happen. Actually, good things haven't happened when we've been on, <laughs> in, on the pole, um, but we're gonna change that. Uh, we must, we must change that. We gotta figure out how to get a, a victory locked down. We gotta get a couple of victories. So yeah, same same procedure as always. We're gonna try and win a race tomorrow. I think we are capable of it. I think we have the car this weekend without a doubt. So um, work on tire dig. That's always what we're working on for the race. Try and get the thing to last tomorrow. If we can do that, I think we have the fastest car out here. So um, yeah, watch out. We're gonna, we're gonna try and get this one done this weekend. Go. How are we doing here this morning, Chief? Oh, we're doing good. How'd your photo shoot go this morning? Dude, I'm so sorry. I know that we were trying to do something this morning and it didn't work out. It was, okay. a, it was a busy morning. You're fired. The, fine. the thing that I like about uh, this weekend though is it's a noon start. Yeah. I love a race start at noon. Yeah. It should just be mandatory that all IndyCar starts are right at, right at noon. Dude, I'm gonna be home by 6.30. I'm like ecstatic. It's fantastic. <laughs> yeah. I never wanna wait. When you wait around until like three, four o'clock, it's really painful. Especially if there's no warm up. Yes, especially if there's no warm up, yeah. That's all good, I'm ready. I feel good. You look good. Well, it's good to hear. It's good to hear. Well, I think it's gonna be the key today. You know, I think that first stint is going to be pretty critical. Um, starting on reds, they got the you know the the chance to wear out quite a bit more than the blacks. I don't think we we don't know the degradation profile 100 percent for this year. Uh, the temperature's up today though; it's hotter than it was yesterday by a good bit. So I think we get to that first stint um, and we'll be looking in a lot better shape. But I feel, you know, our car's been just rock solid all weekend. So it's, you know, it should be in, in our hands to hopefully execute on really just yellows. Yellows can bite you um, in this series. So hopefully nothing silly happens. I wish we could have a bunch of little baby chalices for all you guys after that engine change. Super happy that we caught that yesterday. Uh, hopefully we can have a smooth day. Um, Amazing work all year. You guys have been on it. We definitely deserve a little bit more, I think, for all your efforts. Uh, the person I want to give this to this weekend, sorry, I don't have anything really prepared. Uh, in Road America, specifically, I was really impressed by this individual. I get to spend more time with him than probably anyone else, uh, but he kept us cool. He, he made great decisions all weekend. I thought the decision from Friday to Saturday, what he did with car setup was perfect for the day. It's what helped us have a race winning car for that weekend. Uh, he's an excellent, uh, he's an excellent smoker, as in a uh, uh, barbecue guy. You know, he grills a lot. He's very good. Clarify that. Yeah, he probably is. Not cigarettes or uh, cigars, but uh, on the grill, he does a great job, and it's going to Gavin Ward. Yeah! Thank you, thank you. I am honored. I'm honored. It's a whole. This thing. I haven't got how heavy. It's got some weight. Oh, man. So, uh, you know. This week, I feel like we're here to expel a few demons. Um, you know, I think everybody's frankly had it really covered. But, uh, you know, I'm gonna make sure, I'm gonna wrap things up here. And uh, let's have a great race, everybody. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah. So thrilled we were able to get you know things to go our way. Um, it's been a tough, tough slog the last three races. It's had you know things left and right not going uh, going into place for us. But we've had the speed, we've had the, we've had the team. It's you know it's not for lack of effort. I can tell you that. Um, Yo, man. Wow, yeah, you get, he always gets the body like that. Did you get Paz Dixon there? Yeah. Oh, <laughs> Joe, man. <laughs> we were fighting. My rears were dying. Yeah. <laughs> I was good at the beginning of this thing, and then I just 
sang quite yeah, a lot. Yeah, we came strong there at the Yeah, you were like so much faster. <laughs> Did you find or? Uh, it would have been. They lost that by got caught in. If it was like two, three more laps, Wait. we would have been fighting. Probably he had traffic ahead as well. Right, guys, what? Yeah, it wasn't that though, it was just like my rears were. Uh, the championship here in IndyCar as well. Oh, that's gratuitous drinking footage, yeah. Ah, hydration is key. You know, the body's made up of 86% water and 14% milk. You don't lose a lot of milk when you sweat, though. People don't know that, so that's why they tell you to drink water. You just, you lose milk when you sleep. It's, um, it's, a, it's a scientific phenomenon. We don't know why. Um, but that's why we have so many cows in the world. Yeah. The more you know. It's called a bovine dairy deficiency, I think. That's what it <laughs> All right. Great day. I'm really tired. Uh, it was a hard, hard race. Um, definitely hard fought. It was easier in the first part of each stint. I felt like we had really good speed. Definitely on red tires in the beginning of the race, we were really good. The car was hooked up, had a, had a good balance. Um, was pretty easy on the tires. And then on the, the black compound tires, I just struggled for, I struggled to keep the rear underneath me, particularly with like 10 to 15 laps to go. So Erickson was super tough at the end. I think if the race was five laps longer, we probably would have struggled to, we would have struggled to hold them back or we needed we needed to pit at least to get new tires so um yeah proud of everybody had a great great race here uh, the entire team expel team chevy um so just you know pumped to get a win on the board and now we're going to nashville so uh get ready it's gonna be a lot of fun see you next time